My name is Charles Darwin. I'm visiting here at the Galapagos Islands, which I first came to in 1835 on the voyage of the Beagle. What led me to the theory of evolution? Well, all of my observations during the voyage of the Beagle certainly began my thinking towards that. I wasn't convinced. Shortly after I returned, when other experts began to tell me what I had actually found, I began to realize I had observed what speciation was happening, particularly here in the Galapagos Islands. And so I was actually seeing speciation happening. Species do change over time. But the, the idea of what caused that, and that had always been the great difficulty in my area of work, what causes it? And so I read a book by Malthus in 1838 that revealed to me that there's competition for food among humans. And so I thought that same sort of competition is happening in nature. And so the idea of competition came to my mind. And then I made the connection that that could be a driving force for speciation, would be competition among different organisms. And only those that could successfully compete under the conditions that appeared would go on to make progeny and suddenly perhaps change a bit in order to become new species. So that was a defining moment for me. And from that point on, I was doing research at home and by correspondence and all different ways to gather more information to demonstrate that we could observe speciation and this process of natural selection that I called it in many different forms of life around the world. It took me many years to collect enough data to be able to prove that and finally publish this in the book, The Origin of Species.